Well, last night was a very interesting evening when I opened up the mail and looked at our new tax bill. And it has gone up by $2,000 a month over the first half tips payments that we were previously making up until what will now be July 1. In 2015, we were paying around $46,000 a year in our taxes. Um, this year, we have seen a 99.2% increase from 2015 to 2019. So we're uh, like 95, 94, $95,000 this year alone. So it's, it's, uh, it's quite a steep incline. Uh, if you look at it in over five years, we're paying over 20% compounded annualized increases and you know when you you hear the city talk about what well, we're trying to be revenue neutral we're trying to you know limit these increases to taxes you know in the five percent range it's not that it's not the inflation rate it's it's substantially more and um, unless there's a justification of how you know they can continually ask for more and more money on basically what's happening is a, a shrinking uh, tax base it's it's not sustainable and our assessment is fair I believe that the value that they placed on our property isn't the, isn't the problem it's the mill rate and the mill rate is a direct product of what the civic budget is it's just divided by the total assessed value of properties in the city and what they've done is uh, as they say it's a tax shift because the value of the buildings downtown have gone down but unless you reduce your budget accordingly you have to live within your means and and what they're trying to do is uh, you know basically as as I would look at this if I was an employee would be like going to my boss and saying hey I, I want to buy a new fishing boat I, I need a raise and you know what how that would be you know received not very well and so that's what's happened I feel the city's come to me uh, and my contemporaries and said uh, hey, we want to build a new field house and a new arena and we want you to pay for it. 